Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to download our Freezins pre-flight. So first of all, you're going to want to go to Freezins Connect Me. And then in the home page, just click on Build It. And then click on the Downloads tab. And in this page, under the Profiles and Settings area, there should be an option labeled Pre-Flight Profile. So go ahead and click on it to download it. Alright, and after that's done downloading, go to your File Explorer and go to your Downloads section. So there should be a folder, there should be a file called Pre-Flight Profile. So what you want to do now is extract it because there's a little zipped up icon here. So click on Extract All, press Extract, and just wait for it to extract. Alright, so after you extracted it, there should be a duplicate file labeled the same thing, Pre-Flight Profile. So go ahead and double click on that, double click on the folder inside, and then you'll see that there's two files in here. And one of those files will be our Pre-Flight, which you're going to install onto InDesign. Alright, so what you're going to want to do now is go to InDesign and then install this Pre-Flight. So to do that, Open up InDesign, open up any spread, and then in the uh, bottom middle, there should be a arrow right here labeled Pre-Flight Menu. Go ahead and click on that, and then click on Define Profiles. Alright, and then it's going to open up this pop-up. What you're going to want to do now is click on the three horizontal lines here. Uh, the pre-flight profile menu, click on that, and then click on load profile. And this is going to open up your file explorer. So go ahead and go to your downloads section, go to your pre-flight profile folder, and then click on your Freezen's pre-flight file. And after you do that, you'll see that the Freezen's pre-flight is added to your, your pre-flight profiles. Just press OK, and now you have your pre-flight installed. So just as proof, if you go to your your pre your pre-flight panel and you check your profiles, you'll see that the Freezen's pre-flight is installed. So just click on that and then see if you have any errors that need to be fixed. 